Lowe's the Moat, and welcome back. And hello to all my fruit servers friends. You'll notice that things look a little bit different. I'm wearing a Christmas jumper, but that's, I think that's what they call them. Christmas sweater is what we would call it here in the States. Uh, that's for a, another project I'm working on, but that's all right. Uh, and the spawn here looks different. And that's because fruit servers has a new spawn, a new survival world altogether. So this is my very first look around. Uh, I've spawned in once, um, haven't really done anything at all. And so we're gonna take a look around together and we'll sort of enjoy checking out the new server a little bit. You'll notice what you get when you first walk in, the starter food, starter sword, uh, you know, all basic starter kit. And I've been doing some voting, so I have some fruit party keys. You won't get that unless you do the voting, so that's not part of the starter kit. But that's all I have right now. So we'll go in and we'll try these things out in just a little bit. In the meantime, I switch these around a little bit so I have them the way I'd like them. Uh, oh, a fair amount of food, actually. <laughs> um, nom nom. Uh, and starter food. Excellent. All right. So the other thing, uh, of course, I can do is I, I just want to show you one of the new things here is that uh, you know, go ahead and because I'm a donor, I can get uh, my regular kit. And there it is. Uh, and the iron. Oh yeah. So this up here is the kit, the lemon kit, these six items. Uh, the other thing is I also picked up another nice little thing. This is the virtual chest. And so it exists even when I don't, uh, but I can get to it from anywhere. It's kind of like an ender chest that you carry with you. So I went ahead and got that uh, so that we can use that as we're moving forward. All right, let's um, let me get out of the I can't understand you. So you can follow on Facebook and Twitter. I'll be honest, guys, I don't do Facebook and Twitter. Maybe one of these days, but uh, especially here in the States, Twitter seems, well, I'll, I'll leave that as it is. But 140 characters just doesn't seem like you can say anything worthwhile. Uh, and a lot of the stuff I've seen out there is not particularly worthwhile. Um, so I don't use Twitter and Facebook much, but who knows? Maybe that'll change over time. Um, Fruit server is a friendly survival server. Here's all the good information. Uh, you can also take a look at always at info and rules. That's a good way to find out the details here. Uh, and let's go ahead and just head on out here and see what's out here. Now, this is a very different spawn from last time, which was sort of a big building. Now, let me just bounce things up just a little bit here. Let's see if uh, normally you can't get too far on here, but let's see what we can do. We'll, look at that. A beautiful blood butterfly up there. That's really pretty. A little optifying. Oh, there's somebody up there. Uh, I wonder who's riding that butterfly. Hmm, you'll probably be able to tell from down here. Yeah, interesting. Alrighty. Um, server staff. So that's where you can see who all the staff are. Let's see what some of this stuff. That's an interesting. That's a watermelon slice. Gotcha. What's in here? Interesting. Little house. Somebody's been doing some. So this is a uh, this is much more like the very first spawn. And there's the, the the main section of the big pineapple. I bet you if you climb up there, there's all kinds of interesting things. And we'll explore spawn a little bit more as we go. I want to take a look around, kind of see the major spots. Um, here's spot, Skyblock. Here's the the portals to Skyblock Creative and Hub. Uh, I'm at some point in time. I have some recordings of Skyblock. We'll see. Banana out there. Uh, we'll see if we can, um, hey, now everybody who's come back, uh, it says you're here for the first time. So, <laughs> um, so we'll just say welcome back to them. We've got some cherries here, so pumpkins, so kind of a nice little fruit, uh, fruit, uh, um, theme going here, obviously for fruit servers. Here's the market. So this is where we can come and buy stuff, but of course, Everything was reset, including our balances. So uh, I've got $30 now and that's it. But you know, all kinds of good stuff you can buy in here. This seems to be an expanded one. So that's really good. And I apologize, yes. And normally when people join in, I go ahead and, and do the welcome back here to Server Shop. But uh, you know, when I'm recording, I think we won't, we won't do it. Uh, so here's some of our newest new members. That's a cool little thing. Merry Christmas, yes. Uh, and there's their spawn again, of course. A little banana. Floating banana boat. 
Um, let's see, boat crates. So we're going to come back here in just a moment. Free food, always a good thing. So if you need food, you can come over here and take out some of the, the piggies. Um, the other thing you need to, sorry, but I can't remember like that. Why not? Hmm, that's interesting. All right, can I get you? Oh, he's in the wall, so that's why. Yep, no damage to be done outside of, of the walls here, so that's why this little piggy is, there we go, uh, is um, safe from my attacks. Uh, the other thing you'll notice is everything has been reset. Stats, my MC stats are zero, so uh, that's going to take me a little while. A capucho. Um, so that will take a little while. This way to the wild. So we're gonna we're gonna I'm gonna go out that direction in just a minute. So that's warp wild. Uh, that'll take me out to some location on the server map. I think it's fairly random. And we're gonna go looking for a place to live. And I just wanted to see if there's anything I missed over here. What is this stuff? Um, what are these things here? Uh, so um, oh yeah, here's the donation information. So we're over here at uh well that's us let me so we've got to finish getting those those tags up there uh, but this gives you information on the different donations so that's the donations section all right and then there's i think then we've been around the major piece of it there's more to explore there's hidden things here no doubt in some place there's a uh probably a, a parkour that we could do and marriages. That's the other one I knew would be marriage space. So this is where where you can get married if you want to do so. All right. So let's head back on over. Uh, build projects. Oh, okay. So here's the different build projects. That's good. So you can find out about the build team and what they're doing. So all the information is kind of available. And this is a safe place to come back to. Um, yeah, there's the part. That's the start of the parkour. Way up there. So you can get on up there. If you get up there, you get a prize. I'm not going to embarrass myself by doing that right now. So that's right. Here are the build competition winners. So they'll show up and the players of the month. Right now it is uh, staff of the month, player of the month, but no names. Hmm. Anyway, that's the player and staff of the month there for survival. And here's our build competition winners. So here they have the names. By the way, congratulations on that. At Namas. How do you say that? 80? Uh, vexatious and Le, Command Le Commandant. So good job. Le Commandant was nice enough to create a skin for me for one of my other characters. So that was very nice. And here's the information on server staff. All right, good. All right, so we're going to go through. Has Dragon been killed yet? That's a good question. Um, we're going to go through here and go do our crates real quick. I like all the Christmas decorations, guys. Well done. Uh, by the way, the, for the, the builders, um, the staff who worked on this, this is beautiful. It's gorgeous. I love having this open area to start off with. is really nice to be able to kind of explore. I love the little secrets that I know exist around here. And I'm glad we returned to the more standard type. This I love the last one. The buildings were beautiful. Uh, I think this is a little bit more, you know, it's easier to, to meet up with and do other things. So, you know. Good choice. All right, so let's go ahead and do these um, real quick. I'll probably shrink this down in time, um, just so it's not, well, not a fruit search key, fruit party, hey, the wrong key. So that's what happens when you when you try to get use a key in the wrong place, it bounces you back. Uh, but I'll go ahead and probably speed through this a little bit and uh, just to, to get that done, and then we'll go check for warp wilds. All right, so now we're back and bring that back in. We'll, um, oops, sorry, what am I doing here? Uh, you'll see that I've, I've got some nice things here. I've got a beacon and, a, and some diamonds. That's always a good start. And let me go ahead and put those away. 
Um, I'm going to go ahead and keep them up here for now, not to worry about it. Uh, but also, I now have six thousand seven hundred thirty-seven dollars. So I, I, uh, I picked up sixty-seven hundred dollars. Um, I think the rest was from the pigs, frankly. Uh, so sixty-seven hundred dollars, and so that was eleven fruit crates uh, keys, and then I also picked up a whole bunch of the MC MMO credits for oh, Christmas. Uh, so I picked up a whole bunch of the MC MMO credits. I don't remember picking up quite that much. <laughs> anyway, uh, so I'll be assigning those as we go along. There's something I want to show you with the fishing, so I'll probably assign some rest to them. But we'll do that for a later episode, I think. All right, it seems to be, is it nighttime? No, it's daytime. It's just becoming daytime. All right, so I'm going to go out and see if I can find a place. If you're brand new to the fruit servers, and this is your introduction. Now, who's, who's, who or what's up there? Oh, just a flower. Oh, there is somebody up in there. This is when you want flies. You can go up and see who's who's in all these places. Uh, you can probably parkour up the pineapple, by the way. And there's Pandemodia getting her boat key. Um, but if you're new fruit servers, check out the spawn. It's a safe place here. You can't get hurt here. Uh, you can kind of just check around and, and it's always a safe place to come back to. You can always come back here with a slash spawn. Um, and then uh, when you're ready, you can head on out to the wild. So we're going to go ahead and do that. I'm going to go ahead and use the portal this time through uh, for, oh, look at that. That's, that's, really, that's one of the things I was hoping for. One of the places I want to do is I want to live in a snow zone, in a cold zone. Um, so this is actually a, what kind of a bio, where is it? I always lose track of it. Ice plains. Now, I'm not sure if I want to do an ice plains. I'd rather prefer, you know, prefer a forest and all that, but, um, you know, it's not a bad, bad little start. Nice little, I've got some coal over there if I want to pick it up. But I think we're going to wait and see. I'm not sure this is going to be the right location for us, uh, or at least for me. Maybe the perfect location for you. What do I know? Uh, where am I going? Da, 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 da. Let's get my fog back here. Um, there we go. I like that fuzzy edge. That's just me. Um, all right. So, yeah, I think if I go over this way, we're going to run into... Um, yeah, just a regular. Beautiful. Very nice. I see a little bit of ocean, a little, little bit of, uh, what do you call it, uh, river there. Let me go ahead and take this down just to get this started. I want to be able to pick up different types of trees, of course. But what I would love to have, what I'd love to find, is a um, some kind of nice biome, preferably with a forest, some kind of a cold biome. So I'm going to go ahead and I lose track of where that was planted. Already? I did. Oh, come on. <laughs> uh, there we go. We'll just do that there. Um, and so I've got a couple of couple three saplings, so that's good. That will get me started on my own little farm for that. Oh, good! So it looks like the auction house is also working. Um, I've got an extra one. I'll go ahead and plant that here. Let's go take a look over here and see if we can find anything. Now, I won't uh, bore you guys by all of my search. This is not a bad biome, I have to say. Um, let's see. Not a bad biome by any stretch of the imagination. Oh, bunny, good. Um, so who knows? Let's let's see what happens. Um, I'll take a little look around. Uh, I just happen to like ice biomes. I'm doing a uh, what do you call it? A um, I do a little, a little side project that includes creating a house in an ice biome. And I'm just sort of enjoying it, so I want to create one in an ice biome this time. My son and I had talked about doing that last time. Um, so, uh, what is it? I forgot what it is. I always forget the, the uh, commands. Oh. Hmm. All right, well, I'll take a look at that in just a second. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and make a warp, mark a warp for this one, and then I'm going to probably warp out a couple of different places just to see if I can find it. Um, there's some nice places, but I, I'm maybe looking for an extreme biome. I would like to build up on the side of a, of a hill or a mountain or something. Oh, oh, ice spikes. I'm glad I didn't go too far. Oh, that is going to be tempting. 
That is going to be seriously tempting. Um, I do like the uh, the ice spikes, ice spires. I forgot the exact name of them. Those are very pretty. Um, ooh. Hmm. This is going to be real tempting. Uh, so anyway, but I'm going to look around a little bit more. You, you never buy the first house you look at, right? That's the, the rule, I guess. I don't know if it's not. It should be. Um, okay. Don't jump, rabbit. Silly rabbit. Whoops. Complete fail on that jump. Um, there we go. Just trying to get up and see what's what's over here. Whee! Sliding along this. Ooh. Yeah, see, that's going to be real tempting. This is gorgeous. Uh, well, anyway, so I'm going to take a little break. Um, I won't make you guys watch me as I go wandering around looking for uh, a nice location, but I will come back and, and show you some of the locations I look at and we'll go from there. So we're going to take a short break here. All right, so I'm just coming back for a moment. I'm over here at the shop. Um, I, in my second, um, <laughs> uh, in my second uh, warp to the, to the wilds, jumping through the portal, I ran into a jungle. I'm going to go ahead and I'm not going to go take the time to mine up some iron, but I do want some shears. So I'm going to come over here and buy two uh, so that I can make some shears. And then, let's see, I can't remember the name of the thing I get. So these are my private warps. So don't bother trying to go there. It doesn't work, which should only work for me. Um, but I want to go ahead and pick up. Uh, and probably get what I want just from this guy. Because all I want is, got to go around the other side here, uh, the vines. So I'm going to go ahead and pick those up. Whoops. get that. Uh, so I just wanted to show you this is the second one. I, I, so I found some pretty nice places right off the bat. We'll go looking for the Woodland Mansion at some point here. Um, so I'm going to get these guys um, while I'm at it. Uh, so I just wanted to show you, you know, just kind of stop by so you know where I got the shears and also where I got all these. Whoops, come on. <laughs> there we go. Um, all these vines. So I'll uh, I'll take a break. If I find a good place, we'll we'll come back and do that in just a minute. But we'll I won't bother making you walk through all of these. Uh, the other reason to have the shears is is for sheep and a bed, since I want to go ahead and do that pretty soon. So if I cross some sheep, I'll go ahead and pick back up the recording. So back in a moment. All right, we're back because uh, in my third jump, I'm back actually just a little over there into some ice mountains, and we'll go back there in a minute and take a look um, and see. So hang on just a moment here. Um, let me bring out a friend. Hello. <laughs> so White Curious Lion is out here saying hi. I've just found this igloo and wanted to go take a look so pretty cool little setup this is kind of nice um yeah i guess you want the the uh, carpet <laughs> um so i've you know I've, i know these have been around for a while i'm sure everybody's been through but this is actually the very first oh <laughs> do a little little advertisement right this is the very first time i've run across one naturally you know that hasn't been uh, um, sort of taken already so um, that's kind of an interesting spot I may I may may pick this up for a little while we'll see what happens um, but I wanted to show you guys that, that this had come out that I would have run across so this is kind of cool and I'll probably take a look at those mounds a little bit and we'll be back in a minute to see if that's where we want to be so I'll catch up to you guys in a second all right so we're back the um, uh, the third biome I jumped into was an ice plains and uh, um, I went adventuring and exploring with White Curious Lion um, and um, set up that first igloo as a, as a exploration base. I see names down there but I think that's mobs. 
Um, and uh, just a little bit off from the plains, which are just over there, right there. In fact, uh, White Curious Lion's uh, igloo, I think, is just beyond that site there. We've, we've found two igloos so far. Um, this is a cold Tyaga, and I think someplace in here is probably going to be my new location, my new base. Um, kind of like this, um, that hill right there, it's pretty. It's got an interesting little formation. Let's see if I can get over there without killing myself. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. So this is a little flying island kind of thing there, and this is a separate piece. It'd be kind of fun to play around with that. So let's see what happens. Anyway, um, so this video has been going on for a little while. Um, bopping around doing a bunch of different things, but that's okay. I've got a bunch of pigs down here. Um, yeah, look at that. It'd be kind of fun to maybe do something with that flying island. Uh, there are spiders down below here someplace, right? Down there, those names right there probably. Uh, anyway, so that's going to be it for right now. I think this will probably be it. I'm going to do a touch more exploring, but this looks like a really promising area. And I think this is probably where I'm going to go ahead and make my base, or at least certainly start off with them. Uh, and we'll go from there. Anyway, guys, um, I uh, I really enjoy uh, working and playing on the, on, the, on the server here. So for the owner and the, the, uh, the folks, the... Um, uh, builders and staff and all that you guys have done a beautiful job you know, maintaining server it's a very good server you guys have done a beautiful job with the events and all that hopefully we'll be able to attend some of them fairly soon for me it's about two o'clock in the morning so let's see what happens uh you know good people on here we had a lot of fun playing around this evening and we're going to go ahead and try to do this this series i'll try to do at least one a week if i can maybe more um i'm gonna have to build up some of the things i want to show you some of the new things about mc mmo or at least existing things about mc mmo i forget i'm still out here in the in the wilds at night. Um, so I'm going to work on some of that. Look at that beautiful moon up there. Um, and uh, so we'll start doing that. We'll set up a little bit of automation more than my last base and we'll just start having some fun. I won't make you guys watch everything, you know, building the base and all that. But uh, we'll try to capture the interesting things. We'll talk about some of the MCMMO stuff, some of the other plugins that are available, and just, um, just have some fun on the server. Uh, we'll also go and explore some people's builds. They've just been starting up, but you can see people already have warps going. You know, pig farm just waiting for you to start here. Um, and all kinds of good stuff going on. So we'll give it a shot. So let's, let's see what happens, and um, we'll have some fun. Suggestions, comments, what you'd like to see, what you'd like to learn about, what you'd like to hear about on fruit servers uh, would, are always welcome. Constructive comments and criticisms are always welcome. Um, and I always look forward to hearing you know, some people's suggestions of that beautiful sunrise. With that, we will call this a wrap. And I'll find the right location here in a little bit. Guys, I hope everybody's doing well. We're coming up on the holidays. And so I hope everybody has a great holiday if, if I don't catch you before that. Wolves! I see wolves. Uh, and I have no bones. That's so sad. I'm going to have to go get some bones. Um, and I hope everybody is doing well. So this will be a wrap for this episode. Guys, I hope you're all doing well, and I'll catch you guys all on the flip side.